All right, so let's dive into section five, testing our projects on mobile devices. So as of right now, we have some really awesome augmented reality applications that we have created, but they only really work on the browsers of our computer right now. There really isn't too many ways that we can have our mobile devices use these AR applications. However, what I'm going to go over right now is how to host our websites right now live on the internet using a web service known as Heroku. So we're going to go over what Heroku really is in the first video, which is going over web hosting with Heroku. Then we are going to be deploying our AR.js and our AW.js applications to Heroku. After that, we will take out our mobile devices and we will view our live applications on the internet. So here we are with video one going over web hosting with Heroku. So what is Heroku exactly? Heroku is a cloud-based platform that allows developers to host applications live on the internet in a quick manner. The Heroku platform has a lot of great features that are free for developers. However, depending on site traffic as well as other existing features, you may have to pay a subscription fee. You don't have to worry about that in this section though. We will be using the free services of Heroku and we probably will not have enough site traffic to have to pay a really high cost. So for now, we will use the free web hosting service, as I mentioned before, offered through Heroku to host our two JavaScript AR applications. So first, let's go to the Heroku website, register, and then begin setting up our of applications on our Heroku account. So I have my Heroku account open right now, but if you want to go find the Heroku website, you can just go straight to Heroku and just find it right there at heroku.com. So what we will be going over is we will be using the command line. So I really hope that you guys have used the command line before in order to push code to GitHub. We will be doing the same, but we will be pu pushing code to a Heroku server. If you are unfamiliar with specific Git Heroku commands, then you can check them out following the link right over here at the Dev Center for Heroku. So after you go through the prerequisite and uh, set up your account with Heroku, let's begin setting up our first application. So I have a bunch of different applications right here. Some were testing and some were made with different languages. However, you can set up a new application directly in the Heroku dashboard by just clicking new and then create app. So let's set up our Funhouse app. So we will call this House of Fun. Oh, another thing too is that you actually can't use app capital letters. So you have to call it House of Fun and then AR. So we'll call this here House of Fun AR. And let's just hit create app. It is really that easy. So now what we will be going over is we have to go over these different Git commands. So you can actually log in directly through your command line with Heroku login. And then you just have to change the directory into your project. 